The thing I love most about Access Wines Australia is we build communities. We bring people together with high support needs, like myself, to live in central locations close to people with other similar support needs so they can share supports, which makes it a really efficient way to live. And then on site, we have amazing facilities for those people to be able to you know, go to the gym or go to the pool. Simple things like that are all accessible. And then on top of that, they live in a community which is beside a neighbour that might not have a disability. I've had, I think, five surgeries. So it's been a real tumultuous back and forth in years in hospital. And the, the comfort in knowing that you're going to go home to your own home is a really beautiful thing to have. The thing for me as an amputee, double amputee, you, the, the greatest fear you have is falling. I know that in my place, everything's got a place and, I, and, and it's just where I'm safest and secure. They really have incorporated all of us in, into being their family. You know, you've got good people who are there 24 seven to call on if you need, outside of your normal support workers. Everything's accessible. There's not one thing in that apartment that I can't access easily. My doors are wider. I have an automatic door opener. My bench tops wind down so I can actually sit and cook at my level. So I'm not relying on other people to having to do that for me. I found Accessible Homes Australia. I moved into my own beautiful apartment and I mixed in with people from all ages and it's absolutely amazing. I just live a real normal life. I feel normal myself. Oh, 24 hour care does give me peace of mind. It's been wonderful because I can rest and sleep at night knowing that I've got that care. Whenever I want to, I just press that button. It's been awesome. Tom and Barry are like a um, blessing to us because very now slow I come in from because he's had his own issues and uh, health wise and uh, you know I couldn't be happier. Accessible homes Australia our job is to bring together the tenants and encourage them to work collaboratively to to get the best out of their support model. People don't need to change their providers when they move into our homes. They bring their primary support providers with them. Whoever is their primary day-to-day -day support providers are always welcome in our homes. Um, it's the on-site shared support that we encourage people to, to be a part of and then get an efficiency of support from sharing supports. Building communities that are accessible is my number one goal right now to see people be able to move into a house where they have choice and control about who they live with, where they live, and the ability to, able to operate that house on their own independently and call on supports when they need it. It's actually life-changing for so many people.